After Howard Carter and his team had carried out Anubis, the god of the dead, the view into Tutankhamun's treasury was clear for the photographer Harry Burton. The gilded sculpture of the cow Mehet Wuret, a symbol of heaven, stands in front of the Canopic Shrine. To the left and right of this are two vessels made from calcite, containing materials used for embalming. The gilded statue of the goddess Isis can be seen between the cow's horns. She spreads out her arms protectively in front of the Canopic Shrine. There are several chests lying against the north wall. Some of these have inlays made up of more than 40,000 individual pieces. The chests mainly contain precious artisanal gold work, lavish pectorals made of gold, precious stones and inlays, necklaces, a solar hawk, finger rings, bracelets, earrings, and mirror cases, even painted and gilded sandals. The box, number 269, was crafted in the form of a royal cartouche and included two extraordinary items, a crook and flail, the insignia of pharaonic power in children's size for a child king. 